Here we go, live action. Julian out the back once again. Jeremy's there too. Has a look at this section. Ducks under that curtain. Drives out onto the open face now. Draws that turn out. Up into the pocket of the wave once again. Big speed carbs are off the top. Wilson looking for a steeper wall so he can start to mix things up. Sets up the tube on the inside though. And pushes through the curtain as the wave tries to clamp on him. This way is holding open now though. And he goes into the second section. Still rolling through this one. The hands go up. <laughs> He's giving himself he wants a 10-point ride. That's Mark right. It. Older brother Bart on hand too. He looks they good for celebrating. <laughs> As Potts turns around and throws up a 10 finger claim as well. No, I was going to say, Bart, you look good purple, right? What point of difference? I, I missed it completely. <laughs> <laughs> Just over 13 and a half minutes to go here. And that was one of those waves, again, like Geordie had, where there was no indecision about where he was going to go. He, he didn't have to think, am I going to go for turns? Am I going to stall for the barrel? The thing just threw open. It was presenting, and he just drove straight into it. Well, uh, could it be another 10? That would be hard to deny. I mean, you look at the size of this wave, too. We'll look at the size. I mean, way out on top of the point. He took off very deep. He made sure that he was going to take off on this outside section. Beautiful arc here. And look at this big canvas. Just arcs it all the way through. Again, carrying a ton of speed throughout the entire maneuver. And then he sets up this inside section going, okay, wait, wait, wait. I will pull right in. The second barrel section, though, is money. Look at that. Just a little check made into it. And then three double into that double section. And, of course, comes out. And that's it. Give me 10. That's what I want. Well, let's have a look at it from here, Pete. From the water, it's going to look insane. Well, and that's that first section. So it's so well timed to be able to load it up. Then the check made to get into the second section. This is the double section where he disappears almost and he rides the foam ball again if you know you're riding the foam ball and you come out that's when you know that it's a deep barrel again this is where his timing is impeccable he sets it up just loads up off the bottom he wasn't projecting off the bottom he's actually sloughing speed off the bottom because he wants to pull into that and then again goes through and then that second section he had to do a little pump up to it that's where the forehand having the forehand advantage in the barrel well he uh, has a career in judging Julian Wilson. <laughs> it does, huh? Because he got the score right. It is a 10-point ride. Our third for the day. It looks like he might have busted his board. Where? Or well, he's looking for an equipment change of some sort. Didn't he make it out of that last section? I mean, maybe it happened on he the closeout. Maybe when he uh, he bailed in front of.